Hey everyone, Jay here at Tully BMW in Nashville, New Hampshire. Today I'm going to answer a question that I've been asked by a ton of people is, can you add Apple CarPlay to a vehicle that didn't come with it from the factory? Well, the answer is yes. You don't need to go back to your dealership. You don't need uh, to make a service appointment for it. You can actually do it yourself. So today I want to show you how to do that yourself. So right now I am in a 2017 5 Series with iDrive 6.0, but the process is identical on a vehicle with iDrive 5, which is the one of most 2017 vehicles. Now this does not work on the BMW X1, which does not offer Apple CarPlay. So let's get to the process. We're going to scroll to connect to drive, click on that. Once you're in connected drive, you'll see the option for the connected drive store. If you have just started your vehicle, this option may not show up just yet. It takes about 30 to 45 seconds for all these apps right here to populate. So if you don't see it initially, give it a second to populate. We're gonna click on connected drive store. And then you'll be presented with all the options available at the connected drive store. So it's just Apple CarPlay compatibility, concierge services and the other services that BMW offers. Now, most of these services are complementary for four years to the BMW Connected Drive. On some vehicles, concierge services are also complementary. On this particular vehicle, they are not. This particular vehicle also didn't come with Apple CarPlay from the factory. So if we like to add it to this vehicle, we're gonna click on that. We're going to go to show offers. Read more is essentially gonna tell you what CarPlay does. Uh, so we're gonna go to show offers, click on that. And then it will show you the 20 year subscription for Apple CarPlay at a cost of $300. This is the, this is the exact setup as if the vehicle would have had it pre-installed by the factory. So we're gonna select that and click next. And then it's gonna ask you to log on to your connected drive account to complete the purchase. So there you have it. That is how you can add Apple CarPlay compatibility to a vehicle that didn't have it installed from the factory.